All right, Shalom. When I want to start about giving all praise, honor, and glory to you. How about Shemayah, Shabbat, Shabbat, Shemar, Kakodash, double honor to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and Shalom to all the Akimah, the preaching the word of sincerity and the truth. It's the Brother Barzal from uh, Great Millstone, Atlanta. Yeah, and I just want to go into this article uh, on Blacklisted News. It says, YouTube flags Notre Dame Cathedral fire video as 9-11 conspiracy. Yeah, and what inspired me to, uh, you know, touch on this is, is it showed that this devil, you know, without a shadow of a doubt, is going to block everything pertaining to truth and pertaining to, uh, you know, uh, anything to expose him, his system, which, of course, um, the Notre Dame, you know, is, is still a part of Esau's system, whether it's on the Western world or on the Eastern, Eastern world, the cathedrals, they all come from uh, the Catholic Church, you know, where they all aspects of the Catholic Church, um, which Rome is is part of the B system. So to see that this place burn is a is a uh, basically a spiritual loss, basically a, a spiritual economic loss that has um you know hit Esau, and it's been uh it was put out live of this place burning, you know. But you got YouTube that's gonna flag this video as a nine eleven conspiracy. What the hell? So that shows you this devil man. He He's looking to uh, block anything that's pertaining to true hard facts, uh, true hard facts, man, hard information. So I'm just gonna read a little bit on it. The world was transfixed on Monday when horrific images of Paris Notre Dame Cathedral engulfed in flames were broadcast across social media. Global news outlets in nearly every country were live streaming the devastating fire across platforms like Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. However, those watching the live stream Broadcast on YouTube saw something strange. An excerpt from Encyclopedia Britannica entry regarded the World Trade Center bombing on September 11, 2001, accompanied the footage. And while the text box may seem like a complete non sequitur, it was an actually a disclaimer meant to discourage the spread of what YouTube algorithms mistakenly flagged as a conspiracy theory or fake news. Right, so they. The uh, YouTube algorithm <coughs> expressed this as a fake news, you know, and, and it's pure facts, you know, that this actually occurred, you know, and but this devil, he does not want anything pertaining to truth to actually come out. This whole world has been engulfed <coughs> and is being predicated upon lies, uh, witchcraft, and deceit. You know, my question for, you know, you Jake's. You know, they don't believe we Israelites. Here it is, this devil called this basically a hoax. And, a, you know, uh, basically a lie. So you think that he will actually express that you're the Israelites, your God chosen people? Alright, he's the great deceiver. He is the devil. The word devil simply means liar or deceiver. Anything that pertains to hard truth that if people recognize, it will, it will shift and it will change their whole perception of thinking. This devil will... Um, cover up all right he's all about covering up truth and and uh, inf uh information that pertains to the truth and throwing out a uh, 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 immense amount of lies to the masses of the people because people the pe masses of the people are asleep because of what being stupid all right you have the same as the saying goes ignorance is bliss all right and you have people today that still in america that still don't believe that not uh 9-11 was an inside job, all right? They don't believe in conspiracy theories. They think that conspiracies of the government, uh, such as the Georgia Guidestones killing off the masses of uh, the people, are all a, a lie. When you could go, and we've been to Georgia Guidestones plenty of time. when you could go to, to the Georgia Guidestones and you could see the plaque still hang, hanging uh, on to this day, you know, as well as, like I said, that we the Israelites, that... um. You know, uh, the so-called white men as the devil. All these things that we speak of the truth, they all run to the uh, whole thing that this is a conspiracy theory. And that's how we know without a shadow of a doubt they're going to they're gonna try to cut the Israelites from the internet. Alright? So, I'm just going to read a little bit on this uh, Isaiah 60. It says, Arise, shine, for thy light has come, and the glory of the Lord is risen upon thee. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth, and gross darkness the people... But the Lord shall arise upon thee, and his glory shall be seen upon thee. Right, so the scripture says that the glo glory of the Lord is going to be seen upon thee. But before um, the glory, 
uh, the Lord, which the glory of the Lord is only seen on the, the uh, elect, all right? But the darkness, which is the ignorance and foolishness, folly, deception, and uh, basically not the, the uh, spirit of not knowing and being delusional is uh, covering the earth, all right? Which is, like I said, it's the lies. So the masses of the people, they believe that this government, uh, America, was established upon righteous rights. You know, they believe in the uh, Constitution. They be believe in the Bill of Rights. They believe in the Founding Fathers. They believe in the government itself, not knowing that this government was set up upon wickedness. And the the whole plot of the government is to keep you down, man. And that's mainly pertaining to you, you blacks, you Hispanics, and Native Americans. And if you tell a Negro that, he's not going to believe you. He's not going to believe that America is is perpetually keeping you in a box, keeping you in a hole, keeping you in a system so that you can stay in the system and never rise. All right. Matter of fact, get this scripture. This is Isaiah 42 and 22. But this is a people robbed and spoiled. And who is the people? The Israelites. And who have who has robbed us and who has spoiled us? The so-called white man. All right. They are all of them snared in holes and they are hid in prison houses. They are for a prey and none deliver for a spo spoil and none saith restore. Right. So, you know, that's why I wanted to go into the uh, certain scriptures pertaining to the lies and, and pertaining to the, um, the 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 masses of deceit that this so-called white man puts out. Because this is just a low level live stream, so to speak, of a, a cathedral burning. And these devils have aired that it says it's a conspiracy. More than likely, they're going to try to take it off the internet. More than likely, they're going to try to mark it in the books as basically a lie. You know, something that never actually occurred. Fake news, this, that, and the other. But us being Israelites, God's chosen people prophesying uh, on the highways and byways, especially about America burning. How many other people are going to actually believe that? You, that's why the government, whenever they speak about the Israelites, they speak about uh, us, you know, cussing. Us speaking aggressively, but they never go into the context of the scriptures and really look and inspect every all the scriptures that we're bringing out and see if they're true or not. Because they know if they actually study and actually go into everything that we go into, they can't avoid uh, the, the truth. So they set up these these uh, puppets. All right, they set up these these Negroes that are um, all about kissing the white man's ass to keep you asleep. All right, these Louis Farrakhan's, these um, you know, these rap niggas, you know, all these so-called religious uh, uh, leaders, none of them are for your well-being because all of them are sponsored by the government, and the government's main job is to keep you and elude you from the truth. And I want to end it with this scripture right here, Isaiah twenty-five is seven, and he will destroy in this mountain the f face of the covering cast over all people, and that is spread over all nations. Right. And uh, that that covering is is the lies and trickery, all right? Because most of the masses of the people are are uh, have a covering over them, all right? The Chinese, they don't know that they go back to the Moabites. The Arabs, they don't know that they go back to Ishmael, uh, so on and so forth. The Africans don't know that they're Hamites. Majority of you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, you don't believe that you're Israelites, man. But that's why judgment has to come, and the Mosai has to actually touch this earth and, and push. His spirit through his prophets to show that all these things are so, you know. But this is all I wanted to really go through just to show that this devil is working, you know, behind the scenes. He's still trying to, um, you know, push this conspiracy theory thing, trying to basically uh, put anything that deals with uh, the fall of Esau's system, whether it's in, like I said, Rome, whether in the Vatican, whether in the U.S., whether in Europe, you know. He wants to push these different things as just lies. But it's all truth and it's all facts. So I want to end by giving all praise, honor, and glory to you. How about Shimei, Shabai, Shimei, Kakodash, double honor to the apostles and others of the great millstone. Inshallah, I'm mocking.